G. Welcome back to my channel. So excited you are here. We're going to be doing a whole bunch of awesome couponing today over at the Walgreens and the Rite Aid. So it is Jody Dunn. And that's what I'm coming at you with today is a little Walgreens haul and a Rite Aid haul. If you are new and you just found the channel, I'm so happy you are here. Would you please say hello to me? Let me know that you are new right down there because I would love to welcome you. So excited you are here. And if you are already subscribed, thank you so much for coming back to another video. I appreciate you. Are you all done with your drugstore couponing this week? Or have you not started yet? Let me know. Uh, I keep hearing about this little glitch going on over at the Walgreens with the Dove. So you know I wanted to test that out. We don't get glitches very often at Walgreens. And, um... I have an account that has a spend 20, earn $5 in Walgreens cash. And hallelujah, I just got my PNG coupons finally. So I'm going to pick up some awesome uh, PNG products. And uh, I have a super late start today because I got to babysit my little EJ this morning for a little while. He slept most of the time, of course, because, you know, babies sleep a lot. But I'll pop a little picture up on the screen so you can see him. He's getting so dang big. And so I got a late start today. I didn't even get to the store until, I don't know, around noon or something. But anyways, we got some Walgreens and some Rite Aid action going on today. I had bonus cash at Rite Aid literally expiring today. So I had to go and use that up. Well, I didn't have to, but I didn't want to lose that bonus cash. So, all right, we are going to head into the store. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you so much. Let's go grab some awesome deals. All right, we are in the Walgreens. Super excited that I got my PNG coupons. And I'm going to be working with a spend 20, earn $5 in Walgreens cash digital booster on this transaction. I don't have any paper boosters to work with to make this magical, but that's okay. We're going to make an awesome deal. So I'm going to grab one of the Tide liquids and one of the Tide pods, both on sale for $4.95. And on promotion for if you buy four, you earn back a $6 register reward. So I'm gonna use a $2 coupon on the pods and a $2 coupon on the liquid. And then to complete this transaction, I need six, I need four products. Uh, the third product I'm gonna add is one of the Bounty Essentials. Six equals eight rolls. Those are on sale as well for $4.94. I do have a $1 digital coupon on the app for that. And then I'm going to grab one of the Charmin 4 equals 16 rolls. You can also grab the Charmin Essentials if you want. They are both $4.94. And I have a $1 digital coupon on the app for this product as well. So that'll complete that by four, earn back a $6 register reward. I think I said complete my transaction. But no, of course, we're going to be building this transaction up and using Walgreens cash to pay on a spend deal and letting the coupons pay for the spend requirement. So I'm gonna go ahead and add the Always Discreet products because we have an awesome, we have two awesome Ibotta rebates and we don't get rebates on these very often. So I'm gonna grab two packages of the pads. These are all on sale three for 15 and these actually did not qualify for the Ibotta, Ibotta rebate because they were 20 count. <laughs> So I'm putting those back. That's why I always scan products in the store to make sure. And instead, I'm going to grab these that are 36 count, I think. These do qualify for the Ibotta rebate. And I also have a $5 digital coupon off of two on the app. And then I'm going to go ahead and add in the always discreet liners. Same sale, three for 15. I'm going to grab two of these that they are going to ring up all for $5 each. And I have a $5 digital coupon on the app off of two for the Always Liners as well. Then I have an Ibotta rebate for $5 back when I purchased two of the pads. And an Ibotta rebate for $3 back when I purchased two of the liners. And then to finish out this transaction for my spend 20 earn five, we're going to go for the Colgate toothbrushes. Uh, Colgate toothpaste is also on sale for $3 each. And when you purchase two, you earn back a $5 register reward. My store was just about out of the $3 toothbrushes, but I was able to find two of them. 
Last week, I was able to print printable coupons. I don't think they're any longer available and I could only get one print per browser. So I do have two of these $1 coupons. So these Colgate um, toothbrushes will be a nice little moneymaker. And then I'm gonna use this $5 store coupon on this transaction. So this is gonna complete my spend 20, earn $5 in Walgreens cash. My total for all these products is $45.80. That's why I'm able to use that $5 store coupon because that will just come off as a store discount. Once that comes off, I'll still be at $40.80. So I'll safely be able to use $20 in Walgreens cash and let my coupons pay for a majority of my spend requirement. All right, we are now gonna move on to my second transaction where I am testing out this little glitch that I keep hearing about. Thank you so much to my friend, Jessica. She sent me a message on Sunday afternoon to let me know that uh, she had a little glitch happen. And I was like, oh, I guess I gotta test this. So the Dove is on promotion for buy one, get one half price this week. And when you buy two, you earn back $2 in Walgreens cash. Well, we got um, insert coupons for buy one women's, get one men's free. I'll be honest with you. I was really not even excited to do this deal because I don't want any more Dove men body wash. Nobody seems to use it. <laughs> Everybody likes the women's body wash. I go through that like crazy. So anyways, but to use the coupons, I got to get the men's body wash. So the women's are $7.99 each. One will bring up full price, one will bring up half price. And then the men's are $7.49 each. One of the men's will bring up full price and one of the men's, the other men's will bring up half price. If the cashier scans these coupons, they will take the max value off of $6.49. Now I also have a digital coupon for $3 off. It is an only for you when you purchase two Dove that appears to be glitching and coming off along with the paper coupons. So I'm gonna be testing that today to see if that happens for me. We don't get glitches very often at Walgreens, so I definitely want to see if this works. All right, and I got so many store coupons. I'm gonna go ahead and take advantage of the sale that is going on with the Downy and the Bounce. These are two products I'm running a little bit low on. So I'm gonna grab these. They're on sale four for $8. So um, my Walgreens are pretty strict on coupon limits. If yours aren't and they allow you to use more, go for it. But I'm just gonna use one of these paper coupons for $1 off. And then in this transaction, I am gonna go ahead and use a store coupon for $5 off as a store discount. All right, now let's head over to Rite Aid because I got bonus cash expiring. So we're gonna go ahead and do a transaction over here at the Rite Aid and we're gonna use this awesome $10 off when you purchase $50 in products that you can find right in their sales ad. So I'm gonna build my transaction up to $50 and I won't be using any paper or any digital coupons because those act as kind of like an instant savings. So I'm gonna use all paper coupons in this transaction. So it appears the um, Schick deal is double dipping with the weekly deal. You spend 15, earn $3 in bonus cash and the monthly deal of spend 20, earn $5 in bonus cash. And these are on sale for $6.99 each. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab three of these. So three of these at $6.99 each is gonna total me $20.97. I'm gonna use two insert coupons for $4 off, and then I have a printable coupon for $4 off. So that'll bring me down to $8.97, and I should have earned back $8 in bonus cash. So to make $0.97 cents for all three razors, but that's before my 10 off 50 even comes off. All right, super duper excited to grab the soft soap deal. I'm going for the bigger bottles, but you can grab the smaller bottles as well. Um, but we do have coupons and the smaller bottles don't qualify for those. So they are buy one, get one free. They're priced at $3.29 each. And they are buy two, earn back $2 in bonus cash. I think that is a limit of two. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab four of these soft soaps. So four of these is gonna total $6.58. So I'm gonna go ahead and use four 
of the 50 cent soft soap coupons that we just got in our Sunday inserts because my store does accept coupons on free items. So that'll bring me down to 458 and I'll earn back $4 in bonus cash. It's gonna make each one of these soaps just 14 cents, which is an awesome, awesome deal. All right, I don't have any coupons for this product um, because I've maxed out my prints on both of Stay Free's and Playtex's website. But the Stay Free and Playtex are buy one, get one half price, and you earn back $2 in bonus cash. We also have Ibotta rebates. And I was gonna grab the Playtex, but they only had one. And then I thought, nope, you know what, Jody? Put the other Stay Free back. Grab the one Playtex they have, then you can get two Ibotta rebates. So these are going to total me $8.13. I'll earn back $2 in bonus cash, then submit to Ibotta for $3 back on the Playtex and $1.50 back on the Stay Free. It would make my cost $1.63 for both, but that's before the 10 off 50 even comes off. All right, next up, I did not want to grab any more personal care. <laughs> and we do not get deals very often on Quilted Northern. Nope. These are $12.99 a pack, but they are on sale this week for buy one, get one free. And we haven't had insert coupons in forever and we just got some. So I'm gonna go ahead and use two $1 insert coupons off of the Quilted Northern. So right now with all of these products, I'm at $48.67. So I'm just gonna grab a cheap filler item to get me up to my $50 so I can use that 10 off of 50 coupon that is right in the ad on the app. Uh, that's gonna be it for today. Let's head to the kitchen table and see how everything turned out. All right, we are back at the kitchen table with this Walgreens and this Rite Aid haul. Let's get into this. Got a bunch of good stuff here. And as I told you, I was testing out that transaction. And I'm just going to warn you, that turned out to be a hot dang mess. All right. So my spend 20 earned $5 in Walgreens Cash Digital Booster. So excited. I finally got my PNG coupon. So I grabbed the two Tides, one Pod, one Liquid, one Charmin, and one Bounty. And then I did the Always Discreets for that awesome I bought a rebate. And I got the toothbrushes. So let's take a look at my receipt. So there are my two Tides, my Charmin, and my Bounty. There's the Always Discreet Liners. They all rang up for $5 each. And then there's my two Colgate toothbrushes for $3. So I had the cashier scan that $5 store coupon, which just shows up as a discount. The Tide Pods and the Tide Liquid coupon. And then my two $1 printables for the Colgate. And then all of my digitals came off, which was awesome. So my subtotal was $22.80. I used $20 in Walgreens cash to pay. Paid a subtotal on my PayPal debit card of $2.80. And then I earned back $5.20. $5 for the digital spend booster of spend 20. Earn five. And what the Catalina machine printed me was this nice little advertisement. Uh, so we're gonna be having a deal on Huggies starting 7.25 to 6 to 8.21. Um, $5 on your future order, but it doesn't tell you what you have to do. Oh, spend 25. <laughs> so if you spend 25 in Huggies products, you're gonna get a $5 register reward. This is a Catalina promotion. So Walgreens will not advertise this. And then the Catalina also printed me out my $5 register reward for Colgate and my $6 register reward for purchasing the four participating products, which was the Tide and the Charmin and Bounty. So overall, this transaction was pretty awesome. My cost on this transaction was $25.22 plus my $5 store coupon. So $27.80 was my cost. I earned back $5.20 in Walgreens cash, $11 in register rewards, and submitted to Ibotta for $8 in cash rebates back. So I earned back $24.20 with this transaction. So my cost was $3.60. If I would have had a paper spend booster, but dang it, I haven't got one all week. Uh, and that's just totally fine because they are totally random. I've gone five, six months before without ever getting 
a paper spend booster and I just work with what I have. Um, so $3.60 just for two Tide products I'm great with. But I ended up getting some toilet paper and um, some bounty and two rebates towards my husband's midweek. I bought a um, midweek moneymaker, whatever they're calling it. All right, so then I wanted to do this test transaction because... Like I said, I got the message on Sunday and then a ton of you have also messaged me and I did receive that um, only for you coupon of $3 off. And then I have so many dang store coupons that I need to use up. So I decided to take advantage of the, um, the store had some of the downy in stock and the bounce. So I grabbed those on sale for $2 each and was gonna use my $5 store coupon. So, of course, the women's ring up, buy one, get one half price. And then the men's ring up, buy one, get one half price. And then $2 for each one of my downy and $2 for each one of my bounce. Here's what happened. I love this store so much. They have a bunch of new staff and they have a newer manager or maybe a shift leader. Uh, he hit total. So, you know what happens when they hit total? You can't scan any coupons. And I was like, oh, no. So I said, um, do we just need to void it? And he goes, nope, I'm just going to manually enter them. And I was like, ah, oh, crap, that's not going to be good. <laughs> so, of course, it wasn't. So I don't know if it seems that this glitch is working for everybody. I don't technically know if it's really working because, of course, when you hit total, it automatically takes your digitals off. So there's my dang digital for $3 off. Then he starts entering the coupons. He took off $3.99 for the women's dove. Then he took off $3.79 for the men's dove. Well, he took off $3.79, took off, should have taken off $3.74. Then he entered my $1 coupon for the um, Downey products and my $5 store coupon. And then I said to him, I don't think that's right because the coupon is buy a women's, get a men's for free. And he goes, oh, you're right. So then what he did was he took an additional $2.50 off to make one of my Dove a $6.49 value coming off. So kind of stinks. If they scan those coupons, the coupons will take off the max value of $6.49. So if it would have taken off the max value, that would have been $12.98 coming off. But because he manually entered them, because of hitting total, it took off ten twenty eight for me. So I lost out on $2.70 of savings, which is a bummer. But it is what it is. So my subtotal was eleven ninety three on this. I just used $10 in Walgreens cash to pay and paid my one ninety three dollars subtotal uh, with my PayPal debit card. And I did earn back my $4 in Walgreens cash, two for buying two of the doves, and I did it twice. So my test transaction was a bust because of how it went. <laughs> it is what it is. But the Catalina machine did spit me out a coupon because sometimes we get coupons for $4 off and always discreet. And then OMG, it did spit me out a dang spend booster. Spend 35, earn seven. So grateful that I got this. So I'll use that next week. Um, so there you go. The test transaction was a bust. You can let me know down in the comments. Again, that $3 coupon on the Dove is an only for you, so not every account will get it. If you buy Dove often, then you probably did get it. And it does seem to be glitching when you buy. I don't, I guess you have to buy four. I don't exactly know. Again, I don't even know if it would have glitched for me because he hit total and had to manually enter all the dang coupons. All right, so then I went over to write it because I had bonus cash expiring today that I had to use up. And I decided um, to go ahead and use that coupon, the $10 off a of $50 purchase. Love it when they give us those. And I pretty much, other than the razors, were the only thing I really didn't need or want. I pretty much got everything I wanted. I could have made this transaction much cheaper or probably even a moneymaker if I would have grabbed more personal care products, I just didn't want any more personal care products. So I used up my bonus cash on soap and toilet paper. So I told you in the store, um, 
My store has always accepted coupons on free items. And as long as my store accepts them, I'm going to keep doing that. So I got the Chic, three of them for $6.99 each. All four of my, or all three of my coupons attached. That was my little filler item that I grabbed to get me over 50 because I was like a dollar something short. And it was normally $1.79, but I'm a gold member, so I got a, it rang up for $1.43. There's my Playtex, and there's my um, Stay Free. I would have got two Playtex, but my store only had one of the $5.99 ones, and I wasn't going to get the more expensive ones. And then here's my Soft Soap for $3.29 with my 50 cent coupon. There's my $10 off 50 coming off. There's my free Soft Soap with my 50 cent coupon. There's the other soft soap for $3.29 with my 50 cent coupon. My free soft soap with my 50 cent coupon. There's my quilted northern with my $1 coupon. And then my free quilted northern with my $1 coupon. So my subtotal was $24.10. I just used bonus cash. I didn't pay anything out of pocket. And then I earned back $14 in bonus cash. I still have $3.24 in bonus cash that I need to spend, I think, within the next cent six days. So I've really kind of drained my bonus cash at Rite Aid, which that's totally fine. Um, I love it when I can use store money and turn that into real money on Ibotta rebates. So this transaction cost me $24.10. I earned back $14 in bonus cash and then submitted to Ibotta for $3 back on the Playtex and $1.50 back on the Stay Free. So it makes my cost for this transaction over at Rite Aid $5.60. For two packages of Quilted Northern and four things of soft soap, I am perfectly wonderful with that cost. And it was all store money. So there you go. That's what I got for you today. Fun day shopping at the WEGS and at Rite Aid. Uh, if you enjoy the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. And if you want to share any awesome deals down in the comments that you snagged, feel free to. And I'm going to see you again soon. Bye!